so I've got two people claiming to be either the second coming of Christ or uh, a new prophet or somebody who was prophesied by Christ to bring new messages. And then I've got uh, somebody who took issue with a term that was coined not by me, but by people decades ago, fundamentalist atheists. Uh, it's easier than me saying ev a proselytizing evangelical fundamentalist Christian gone one god less. Um, and it's a pretty common term around the internet, and I say I'm using it the way Tecton TV is using it. And I get somebody that argues with me who would argue about things like jumbo shrimp or uh, bittersweet. Well, how can that be and this and that and it just makes you look like an, I mean, all these insults like an ass clown and this and that. The reason why I mentioned fundy atheists, I didn't even think I said fundamentalist atheists, I think it's fundy atheists, is to denote them, that loud minority from the sane, rational. Um, atheists I was speaking about those who would lie in order to get people to join atheism those who think that atheism is an actual movement or religion there are people out there there are even organizations like A plus atheism or, or uh, uh, atheism plus where it's not just the lack of belief in a god. It's more, atheism is more than that to them. Um, and again, there's a video that's not uploading. Um, what, uh, fundamentalist Christianity began <coughs> around the turn of the last century by um, a politician of the Democratic Party. Um, in the United States. He wrote a series of books called The Fundamentals. Um, but before that, and I mean, what are the fundamentals of Christianity? I mean, I'd like to hear this person list any of them. Uh, because they... Probably, are. I mean, there's, there's dogmas of certain churches. Certain, I mean, you have the the five historical churches that had existed since the beginning. You know, at least since before Constantine. Let's just say, just to be, you know, accommodating to the the uh the ex the extremists out there um, but then again not all doctrine is dogma and are dogmas fundamentals do they count um and again which church should you be going by and you, when we say Christianity, we'd have to lump in the West as well as the Roman, the, the West, the Western Protestants and Bible churches as well as the Roman Catholic, as well as the Eastern Orthodox Communion, as well as the Oriental Orthodox Communion, as well as the Assyrian Church of the East. Um of just the existing. I mean, we could go into Manichaean and, um, if you want to call that Christian, and Gnostic, like Valentinian, Basilidian, Marcionite, Arian. Well, Joe's Witness. So, 
No, I don't think there are fundamentals. I mean, there are a set of books that the guy wrote, but as of there are fundamentals of Christianity, like you could say, all Christians believe A, B, and C, or all major churches believe A, B, and C. No, I don't think you could make a list like that. Peace to you.